a bit scary. It's a little bit fun, satisfying. It's sandal. Hi. What if I told you that there is a hidden gem in Embu County, Kenya that you probably didn't know about? I'm talking about Camp Ndunda Falls. So today I'm heading to Camp Ndunda Falls and because I know we are going to interact a lot with nature today, make sure to carry a better bag than this one. A pro a probably a backpack would be ideal. Make sure that you wear good hiking shoes because a lot of interacting with nature and all that. I do not have better shoes so I have to wear what I have and make sure to carry a bottle of water because you might get thirsty. So everything I know about Camp Ndunda at this point I got it from the internet. So we are basically exploring Camp Ndunda together for the first time. So how about we just go. I hope you're excited for this like I am. I am excited but the weather today is not that nice but we have to do this. We gotta do this. So let's go. So it's opposite Embu Level 5 Hospital. Not the camp itself, but the road the road going to the camp. I don't think there is any clear directions on the internet of how to get to Camp Ndunda Falls. It's hidden over there. And after 10 minutes, I got a taxi that was heading to Camp Ndunda direction. Dunda. Right, so we begin by registering ourselves for the gate. So the 350 is nature walk and canopy. canopy. Yeah. Do you have guides? Yeah. Okay. Do you pay the guide separately, Emma? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. Guide me if I tap our guide. On a restaurant here, but in operate on order. Two are ready meals. On order. Wana kalishanga sana. Kuna tegemea ni food gani. Okay. So I think I'll do the 350, the canopy walk na nature trail. trail. I'm not sure ni mevavia to the right shoes. Okay. Ni kona doll shoes. So. Oh, I am at the reception. I have been given, um, do we call it a brunch work? It has their prizes and everything you can do around here. This is the reception. There's a um, scouts group here. Clearly that place is noisy. So I'm leaving the reception. I've been given a brochure with everything they offer, but uh, the basics. Adults, 350 shillings for is the entrance fee, and then canopy walk and nature trail are covered by the 350 shillings. If you want zip lining, wild swing, mud fun events, archery, archery, archery. Na rock climbing, the restaurant you will be charged a thousand. Ama there's a price for each activity. For deep line, uh, while seeing 500, actually 350. Oh, yes, I've been given a guide. Uh, so unfortunate that there are no groups doing these activities today, so it has to be just me and my guide. Yeah. So get better shoes than mine, get the right attire because the nature trail starts here. If you're not barefoot then you're overdressed. <laughs> if you're not lost, you're not much of an explorer. Okay. Nature is a place to visit. It is home. Do not litter kindly adhere to the guides. Signature instructions, litter bin. Interesting. So we are starting here. This is the nature nature trail. Is it muddy? Kuna matope. 
at this point i could not help but laugh because i just realized how bad the kind of shoes i was wearing were nitajitoa eh nitajitoa kwa hizo matope na hizi viatu i need viatu kama hizo za kwa za kwenda nga hike and even before we went too far we were joined by another guide this cat is well familiar with this trail oops kimgonga for people who like forest bathing there is a perfect place for you here mukoyo mukoyo is the tree Rest. And these are all the activities along this trail. Waterfalls, rock climbing, canopy walk, wild swing, zip lining, fishing, fishing, camping, caves. Up trust. Okay. okay, let me talk to my people. So we're going to the waterfalls. I can already hear I can already hear the sound of the falls. Okay, so yes, we are going to the can to the canopy walk where we'll be seeing the falls. So that's along the way. Slippery. Yeah. To make it less slippery. Here we have the wall tree. In that the small one. Mm. And the second one that is on your harness is locked on the second one. So the, the two carabiners are joined there so that you can double safety. That's all. So even the one. No, no. Neither two are here as a man too. I'm here to relax you. Oh, you're here. It's cause you you're used to it. There's this chain that is coming all the way from the tree up there so you will be tied down here and then you will swing all the way to that tree that is there and then you will come back. The wild swing is a high risk activity. I don't think I can try but for those people who love adrenaline stuff, feel free. There's even a till number here for you to pay it's 500 shillings yeah let's proceed we are going to we are still yeah we are still on our way to the canopy walk and the and the falls and we still have my friend here my other guide so when we got here we got this crazy idea to go to the river and see the falls from there instead of watching the falls from the canopy walk it was clearly a bad idea that even the cat did not agree with yep that just happened okay bad idea we cannot go to we cannot go to the falls I'm just going to see it over the canopy walk. I almost fell. Not I almost fell. I fell. Nimeshtuka. If I step on that kawood, I'll slide. Twenty. So we are the canopy walk. We are here to see. We are here to do the canopy walk and see the falls and the river. You can spend a whole day here. Ah, yeah. Let's do this. Me se manishkiliya simo vizuri. So we are starting the canopy walk. It's a little shaky. And I'm scared a little. Mm. 
we can already see the falls we have one over there and we have another smaller falls guy we don't see the falls this thing. we have another small smaller fall over here over here so maybe when i walk when i walk a bit to that side i'll be able to see it a bit more clearly and it's so hard for me to feel when i'm still working on this canopy walk because it's too shaky it's too shaky and when you look down you can see the water and you get even more scared so ha. let's go so during other seasons when the water is a little more cleaner than this people swim here especially on this smaller fall If I continued walking the way we were walking down there, we will have come this way all the way to this place that has rocks here. But because I fell and felt scared, we abandoned that. But if you're confident enough, you can come swim here. Papa is it. Let's walk on. We've come from this side, so now we are going to this side. As in, you don't go back using the same route that you used to come. So, yeah, so we were seeing the smaller fall, which is that one over there. Now we are going to the bigger fall. Do this. Oh yeah, there's a bush here, and I'm scared for my phone. So see you later. the idea is a bit scary it's a little bit fun satisfying it's, it's undescribable so if you want the experience you can only visit and have the experience for yourself successively completed the canopy walk and this place looks as in it's the most beautiful I love it's just here let me walk to the end before my phone drops the coolest place I've seen in a while I feel like staying here a little bit more people swim here people swim here and by the way this is this is a zip lining can it even be seen This one over here is for zip lining, so it starts all the way from there, this way, and then when you get there, you get into this other zip line, all the way to that point. And so after the trail, the canopy walk experience, seeing the falls, we decided to spend a little more time bonding with nature around here. It was so therapeutic being here, it was so cool being here, it's so indescribable. 
if you enjoyed watching if you like this kind of stuff please give this video a thumbs up if you're not subscribed kindly subscribe help thank you so much for watching stay tuned because next i will be back with a tour or a review of this whole kamnuda place and it will be so enjoyable so stay tuned see you in the next one bye